anything at all about the poisoning incident that we've heard of, whether you believe Russia might be... So I really don't know anything because I, I'm disconnected from the flow of confidential information. I sympathize my colleague Kirill Budanov uh, when someone whom you love, and someone you, like your wife or your family member, is uh, f feels sick or is under attack. <clears throat> that's, uh, that's a big, uh, big issue. Uh, I think, I mean, it would make sense to assume that uh, it was an uh, uh, attempted, an attempt on, on, on her life, because we know that Russia previously uh, had tried to assassinate uh, Budano himself, but I don't have access to information to come to any kind of specific conclusion. So it makes sense to assume that, but I need more information to have my full judgment on this. Of, uh, European and American money and we're waiting for a decision perhaps at the summit. Uh, well, I heard a clear no to any reference to fatigue and uh, I heard clear yes to increased support to Ukraine. And this is reflected both in the commitments that allies announced, some very specific commitments, uh, but also in the reiteration of the deep conviction of allies that our fight is their fight. And they understand that in order for them to feel safe, in order for them not to end up in a situation when NATO soldiers will have to fight, Ukraine has to win in this war with the support of allies.